Good morning everyone, this is Teacher Al and I will be teaching you grammar. Okay, but before that, let me tell you the objective of this lesson. Uh, at the end of this lesson, you will be able to learn or to know the meaning of nouns, to differentiate the two types of noun, and to use it in English language. Okay, so let me discuss to you what is the meaning of noun. We have noun here, okay. Noun is the name of person, place, thing, and animals. Okay, in English language, we have two kinds of nouns. We have proper noun and common noun. But before that, I will give you the examples of nouns. Like for example, city is a place, Samsung is a thing, pencil is a thing, paper is a thing, table is a thing, pure gold, your goal is a supermarket, it is a place, okay? Philippines is a place because it is a country. Korea is a place, dog is a name of animal. Cat is also a name of animal. Maria is a name of uh, person. And Tony is a name of person. So let me uh, dissect or let me put them to the types of nouns. So let me, get, let me begin with the city. So city is a common noun, okay? What is a common noun? Common noun is a general name of person and proper noun is a specific name of person, okay? So common noun, they usually begin with a small letter. Like for example, we have here city, okay? City, all right. I will give you the counterpart of city in proper noun. We have Angeles City. Okay, as you can see, uh, Angeles City begin with capital letter because it is a proper noun. And we have City, it begins with small letter because it is a common noun. Another example we have is Samsung. Okay, Samsung is a name of a thing, right? So it belongs to a uh, proper noun because it is a specific name of a thing. Okay, I will put it here, Samsung. Okay, the counterpart of Samsung we have cell phone. Okay, because Samsung is a cell phone, right? Okay, all right. Another we have pencil. Okay, so pencil is a common noun. It begins with a small letter, okay? And then, the counterpart of pencil for a proper noun is mongol. Okay, another example is Philippine. Philippine is a, a proper noun because it's a specific name of country. I will put it down here, okay? So, Philippine is a country. All right, another example we have is pure gold, okay. Pure gold is a proper noun. I will put it there, here. There you go. And the counterpart of pure gold into common noun is supermarket. It begins with small letter. There you go, okay. So another example is dog. Okay, dog is a common noun. Why is it a common noun? Because it begins with small letter and it doesn't have name. So, I will give it the proper noun of dog. Okay, we have the name now. Now is a dog, that is the name of the animal. And last but not the least, Maria. Okay, Maria is a proper noun because it is, specific, it is a specific name of a person, okay? So the counterpart of Maria is student. That's the common noun, okay? So do you have any question about our lesson for today? Remember, noun is the name of person, place, thing, or animal. There are two types of noun. We have proper noun and common noun. This is the proper noun is a specific name of noun. Common noun is a general name of noun. All right, so for your homework, I will give you this homework and you will pass it tomorrow. 
you just put it in the white uh, band paper. Research about verb and the two types of verb. Okay, the regular verb and irregular verb. Give each items 20. Okay, I need 20 items for each verb. Alright, so that ends for today's lesson. Thank you very much and have a good day.